do, I do it with a passion. If I gotta be a bitch, I'ma be a b Hey beauties, Anika here. So, one, let's address the elephant in the room. I have definitely been gone for longer than I ever should have been. And I could give you guys a billion excuses. Um, college, sickness, things happen. I mean, if you guys really want a video on what happened, I can give a video, but I don't know how many people will really care about like why I wasn't posting as to just the fact that I wasn't posting. And I didn't mean to like leave for so long, but like things happened, college was happening. Speaking of, I just graduated. <laughs> Of 2017 with my bachelor's in psychology um, so if anybody would like like a video about college or anything like that leave comments below um, so today I have so many videos like that I have in store or in mind or like that I've just been thinking about or planning but haven't been able to execute however today we're gonna do a haul video because I got a whole bunch of stuff like I went to TJ Maxx one day I just took myself out like I have days where I just not like I don't want to be around anybody but like when you just want me time and I had one of those days and I feel like everybody should but I can talk about that in like a chit chat, chin chat get ready with me or like a makeup video or something but um I basically just went out and treated myself and like bought stuff and um took myself out to dinner just be my, me by myself and I ended up with a whole lot of stuff and then some of this is from yesterday when I went out with my best friend just because there's a Victoria's Secret sale and then we ended up just in the mall for a long time um if you see boxes behind me don't mind that I'm moving back to New York thank god um so I, that's why there's boxes in the background um so yes let's get into this video and don't forget to like comment share and subscribe because why would you not like don't you want to be popping popping yes not popping you just want to be popping okay and so i picked up this bag from betsy johnson tj maxx tj maxx is the goat like you can literally get anything on sale and it's a beautiful store like if you want to like buy a high-end purse or something like that so i ended up getting this just for my like everyday wear bag like if i'm just hanging out with my friends because now i don't have to use a school bag anymore so i just bought this um if you want an updated what's in my bag or what's in my purse video i can do that i mean i it's probably the same as last time um this bag only cost me 40 dollars 30 dollars oh no this might have been 50 dollars 50 dollars um but that's compared to like it was like originally 80 or 90 or something like that so tj maxx is the goat if you want a nice bag TJ Maxx um yeah my old Betsy Johnson was like leaking and I used it forever like my, my, my aunt gave it to me freshman year and I used it all the way till this year and it was time to go like I didn't want to give it up and eventually my mom threw it out and I it's not like I couldn't part ways with it but it's just it was like a witch's bag like and all of them are like that this one's like that too like one time I fit two sets of stilettos like two pair like a pair one two shoes um of stilettos into that bag like what do you mean like oh so yeah this bag does that too like I think it's just a Betsy Johnson bag thing like it's just spacious um second thing I bought I still have the tags on this one um this bag I was ever since I got my Michael Kors watch I always wanted a Michael Kors purse like I love Michael Kors um and as far as I know he hasn't said anything disrespectful about black people um correct me if I'm wrong but um yeah I mean I wasn't gonna put this in the video at first because I know how people on YouTube are about like nice things and like people think you're bragging but like to be honest I deserve the right to brag like I literally came from nothing I came I was born and raised in Flatbush in Brooklyn uh, in the ghetto like gunshots outside my house every single night I could hear them and I made it through college with a life-threatening illness that I was born with and I can't do anything about 
and if I want to buy my if I want to buy me a nice bag, I'm gonna buy me a nice bag. So, um, this is going to be my work bag. So, like, when I get back to New York and I have my job and stuff like that, I'm going to use it as my bag that I go to work in. Like, this has been sleeping on my bed. Like, I haven't taken the tissue out or the, like, the, the formers, like, at all. Like, it's literally has not moved from my bed. I will not move it. Um, I love this bag. And I don't feel like talking about how much it costs. If y'all really want to know how much it costs, go to TJ Maxx. All the Michael Kors braces are the same price. Don't know why. Unless they're on sale or clearance but um yeah i just put like a turquoise puffball on it because to make it look cuter and more me um i figured nude because it just goes with everything like i can wear it in winter summer fall spring every all year round um and they didn't have a black one to it so nude it was um so if you want to see the specs on that bag i guess you can ask about it or like when I start work I can do like what's in my work bag video as in like not just like my everyday purse video so I went to this store called G stage um if anybody remembers like that like online shop G stage love um now it's GS love and they have actual like stores like actual boutiques so um I don't know if they have any in New York we're gonna find out but um the first thing I bought was this romper. It's outside the bag because I wore it home. Um, the one I wore, like, I just felt like I needed to go romper shopping. I had not really bought rompers. I just buy rompers, like, when I need to an uh, outfit for something. But, like, I just went, like, oh, I need rompers. And we're not going to get a romp him topic. But um, I was wearing a black one and it was like 90 degrees out and I was burning and it was just not working so I decided and it was like a tight one too it's a fitted one um so I decided to buy one that's flowy and this is the color I picked out I love this one like I would do a try on haul for y'all but I'm not there yet so maybe back when I get back to New York or maybe when I get my own place I'll start trying hauls but yeah we're not there yet um this is a medium I have been getting bigger I don't want to say fat because I'm never going to be fat, but I can't fit into small clothes anymore. I'll, this also didn't, I couldn't find it in a small, but this medium fits me perfectly. Um, I weigh more. I'm just, I don't know, maybe after I graduated, like, aren't you supposed to gain weight when you're in college? So I'm hoping when I get back to New York and I have to like, you know, run up and down Metro stairs that I will not be like this anymore. And I do a lot more walking in New York, but like... I don't know why I'm getting bigger. I've literally been eating the same thing I've been eating my whole life. So, yeah, um, this romper. And basically this bag is just full of rompers. Um, I bought this one. It's not like a work one, but it's like a, you know, like the co-workers said, let's go out after work and you want to be cute kind of romper. Um, or just like a, not a business meeting, but just like a, different type of event like you wouldn't just wear this walking down the street i mean you can do it do what you do what you want when you pop in this romper also just dressy i have hopefully i'll be going to my high school's graduation um and i probably wear this um it's just a long sleeve one i really was trying to look for short sleeves ones but this one's cute so um and it has like frills at the bottom all of these have flowers oh I don't, I don't like flowers, like, in real life, but I like flowers on clothing. I don't know why. Anyway, um, yeah, and it has, like, a hole in the back, so, like, you can't really wear a bra with it. Um, you can wear, like, a bralette or, like, sticky boot or, like, sticky petals, like, on your poops or whatever. But, yeah, there was that one. And then, there's another one in here. I bought this one I wasn't going to because it fit a little weird a little tight maybe it's just because I'm getting bigger um this is a small everything else was a small I believe oh no this one was a medium the long sleeve one but um why did I like this one I like this for a specific oh it made my boobs look nice like it's the first one that fits like most of them are flowy around this area and it's the first one that like just fit my boobs like so I bought this one and it's like a tie back like that and it has like a crochet middle section so like a little peaky peaky and then I bought this because my best friend decided she wanted to be extra and throw a girls night which is fine um 
but I mean we're getting older we're all gonna be 20 like she's gonna be 22 soon or most of us are 22 already and um she wanted to have like a themed girls night and her theme is Hawaii so we're all required to wear cruise attire so I'm gonna wear like this shawl I mean I can wear this other times too but I bought this specifically for this event like I'm gonna wear like this shawl over like or like this kimono whatever they're calling it nowadays um over um like a bathing suit or like a romper or something like that because that's what I would wear on a cruise <laughs> I also went there yesterday because my other friend took me to uh UPS so that I could start shipping boxes and I left something at home so she came back to get it so while she was back here I ended up back in this store again um oh each of those rompers were about like $20 and so was the shawl so like if, like one of them was like $15.99 but everything else was $20 um I got these rose gold sandals I wanted like a pair of sandals like this that were like white for a long time but I couldn't find any or everybody who bought my size. Um, I might go back to the gold ones, but I'm not a big fan on gold. But these rose gold ones are fire. So I bought that. Size 9. And then I bought a choker because I can't resist buying chokers, apparently. Oh, okay. Ooh. It's one of those chokers that, like, you put around your neck and then this part comes down like through here so i might wear this with like a romper or something like really cutesy um eh. and then that's me a bracelet that matches this i wasn't gonna buy the bracelet originally but then i ended up buying i wasn't gonna buy anything in the store but then when i bought one thing i bought everything so yeah i have a rose gold choker that i got for my birthday and i have no idea where it is like i wore it on my birthday and it's nowhere to be found I feel like it's under something. Like, I'll find it when I'm packing. The day that I went to talk TJ Maxx and stuff, I stopped in uh, Fashion Cube because I was looking for, I was looking for, I wasn't looking for ears. I was looking for something. Rompers. Rompers. I was just literally romper shopping that day. Um, But I didn't find any in there that I liked, but I found sandals. I am a sandal junkie. I That's the only thing I'm a miss about California, being able to wear sandals pretty much year-round. Um... I don't know why I could find this many, like I have anywhere to wear them or anything like But I literally have sorry if the position of the camera changed. I um my phone decided to tell me that it was dead. Uh or not dead. Um full. So back to where we are at. Uh sandals. Um also if you hear music in the background, that's not me roommate. Sorry. Anyway, um yeah, so these sandals, I'm literally looking at a pair of sandals that I own just like it. Like, I have an addiction to these types of sandals. And, like, this one, the other one has just like this, but it's cloth instead. But it doesn't have the gold part, so the gold part is what's only. Plus, it wasn't that expensive, so I was like, whatever. It was, like, it was 12 it was $13. Just like and somehow I ended up with a pair of sunglasses, too. So, you know, when I'm feeling a little shady. Um, yeah, I spend a lot of time. So oh, I bought a choker, too. Huh. Would you look at that? Anyway, yeah, I bought a choker. Rose gold, too, because it's the color I like now. Because, like, my laptop case is rose gold. My iPad case is rose gold. Everything's rose gold. I went to the Toy Secret. Just got some underwear yesterday. Nothing too uh, spontaneous. Just black underwear. Because I had a theme for graduation it was all white or white and gold and i decided to buy all my clothes in white and then realized i had no black underwear so i don't want that to happen to me again because i have a christening to attend and i know i'm gonna wear white so i'm gonna really need to have black underwear um and then i also got this oh what's the top this is a little version of the night spray oh after this i can put it in my bag um i love this spray it's probably my signature scent this and the um <clears throat> why oh, sell like i have to figure out what it's called because i went into the store for yesterday and i did not even know what it's called but um it's a ysl perfume it's like a gold bottle with a purple top um but this and that are my two favorite scents 
and of course I have to be luxurious but um this is normally $15 and it was six they're on sale for six I'm so glad I picked it up I was planning to spend $15 on it spend $15 on it because I knew that I had the money on me right now and if I didn't like anytime later if I didn't have the amount of money that I had I would not have bought it but um I'm glad I picked it up because it ended up just being $6 so yeah oh I can put that in my bag now TJ Maxx aside from these two bags I got another bag because I'm a bad whore um <laughs> what kind of bag even is this oh um <clears throat> this one was only this one was on clearance and it was $16 um it's just like for when I want to go out with my friends and like I don't want to take a super little purse but I want to be able to fit like like my wallet can fit in here and um anything else I need except my water bottle but if I'm going out I don't need it um <clears throat> yeah it's like super little and cute and it was white so I figured it goes most of my outfits and it has emojis on it some of my favorites the bow the hard eyes I wish this was the pink heart with the sparkles but it's fine and the peace side because <laughs> Bye. Um. Uh, thank you. Last but not least, that's everything from TJ Maxx. Oh wait, the Betsy bag was from Marshalls. So those two bags were from TJ, and then that bag was from Marshalls because they're all in the same complex, and I forgot that they're different stores, but like the same under the same bracket. So yeah. And the last thing, I went to Michaels. Um. This is this haul is all over the place. I literally was at every store. Um, but I got an A. Oh, this is my okay, to paint for me because I want to paint it pink or no, pink and gold or like um gold glitter, um and put it on my wall, um wherever I'm at. So like probably my brother's house and then when I get my apartment over my bed and then um these people don't watch my videos so we should be fine. And even if this person sees it, it's eh, yeah. So I got an N. Um, the christening I'm going to attend is my future goddaughter. Um, my friend and a girl who I called my daughter in high school, she asked me to be the goddaughter of her daughter, Nerea, which is ironic because that's what I want to name my first child, first daughter. Um, <clears throat> but I'm going to paint this N for her to give at the christening along with another present that I got. It's like a picture frame with like all of all 12 like months so she could put like what she looked at one month two months three months all the way to one year um and then i got an l <laughs> i take no l's no <laughs> for my mom i'm gonna paint this um she's definitely not gonna watch this video so it's fine um and give it to my mom along with a tea set that what is her tea set it's somewhere in this room but along with the tea set that i bought for her because um i went study abroad I was in China this year and I had um she wanted white tea so I bought her white tea um but I forgot to give her the tea set to go with it and or I didn't forget but I gave her the white tea and I, immediately when I came back and then I was like I don't have time for her to be like oh you didn't get me anything from Mother's Day even though I ended up getting her other stuff anyways um I bought her um this L so that I can like paint it because my mom's name is Lynn if you guys remember from my mom tag and um so she can hang this over her bed in her house um yeah. and then just like some Mod Podge and this to put it on and the glitter for my A I hope this is enough glitter but this is like some really pretty gold glitter like my A gonna be I have to do this outside though because I'm not about to get this whole like everything just dirty but um my a about to be shove hopping shove hopping and that is i was all types of hunch just now that is everything um for now i mean i went to h&m yesterday too but i have to return to those things the other thing is a romper and it's a floral romper um and i bought a blazer because I have a job interview when I get back to New York and I just feel like I need a blazer. I don't own one. Um, if anybody thinks I'm going to brag about this stuff, like I love being able to treat myself and buy stuff now that I've graduated, but like it's not to like, oh my God, like this is what I have. Like, I mean, some things, some people do deserve to brag about because they've worked very hard for it. But um, yeah, this is not me bragging. I just 
like nice stuff <laughs> so i will see you guys in my next video hopefully that is soon and hopefully it is a story time that i promise you guys you want to hear because bitches out here is crazy okay love you and stay shit popping she bad and she know it, some niggas save hoes I'm not that heroic, could you be my escort? Cause just like them two door fours Damn, they don't make them like you no more